Welcome, my lovely dears. What a fantabulous, shiny, and perfect morning it is. For the Western Chivalrix. When the mimics last... are chirping. Yeah. The Western Chival mimics. When last we left off, our Grand Crusaders made their way down to the Mimic Dungeon. I know. How surprising. It's finally it happened. So long. It's finally happened for you all. <clears throat> of course, on the way, you bumped into uh, uh, an assimilating lizard creature. Uh, bounced from body to body and did nasty things. You dispatched him with relative ease, regardless. Because I can't roll dice to save my life. Sometimes that's the way of things. Upon reaching the entrance to the Mimic Dungeon, or so you've been led to expect, you have seen a completely normal and innocuous pile of gold and coins, and a totally normal chest, and a knight who informed you that, obviously, all of these riches, it would be a shame if they went to the forces of darkness, but there are far too many for him to leave with. Why not share the burden? And then he was a little bit rumbled. And now there's a fight. Like, like he wasn't completely obvious, and Tyana just... No, he was, was disappointed. So he in was him. he was he was a knight, and he's surrounded by totally normal sets of armor. Diana's just so disappointed in him. And he is with one even, of those. Like you didn't even try to play along. Yeah, he, he was so he's just surprised. In you. It's like, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> we're disappointed in each other. Uh, yes. As, There's a proper uh, order of events to the things, you know? You can't just deal his thunder like that. Exactly. He was so flustered. And uh, so it is that the first of the totally normal armors will attack. Uh, We're on the wrong screen. Against... We're on the wrong screen. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I tried to drag you over and I must have let go too early. Blunk. There we go. Okay. Yeah. The first of the totally normal armors is ready to attack. He will slosh towards the mare. I dare he. Swing, swing. Uh, neither of those will hit. Plink, plonk. Well, that's Allie good. has quite a bit of armor. Look, they don't do acid damage. It's totally normal damage from these normal weapons. Yeah, you can't you can't uh, damage reduction if it's a totally normal damage. Uh, all right, Jesse is gonna help because of course she's gonna help. Stabo. Oh. Oh. Oh no. Oh, well, luckily she can't. Knife. Yeah, luckily she can't be disarmed of her soul knife, but she's not going to get that offhand attack. I think she has to reform it, which is only you got to do with with one action in a turn anyway. Bonra. Oh dear. Oh, I guess here I well here I go killing again. Oh boy, okay. here I go killing again. Enrage. rage. Did yeah. I? Hang on, did I? Did I put... No, I did not. Last week, I did not. There's... Oh, wait. Right, I remember now why I didn't. Because she's a non-combatant. Tiara's not going to be fighting in this dungeon. That's right. Correct. She's got massive, massive uh, harm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Poor Babsy is just going to be staying out here and keeping watch on you guys. It's pretty good double swing, uh, apart from the fact that uh, the second one, your life-bonded claymore, gets stuck inside this lad. You sort of, like, 
wiggles his hips and dislodges it from your grasp. You have made a very grave error. Uh, but you do still hit him with the first attack for 14, 16, 23. Gary. Don't so worry, Ginger. weird saying I'll that during out. shifts. <laughs> All right. Uh, whack. And... I was really waiting for your crit fail. There we oh, go. There it is. <laughs> wow. This uh, is great. This is this great. Guy, this guy will also claim your weapon in his abdomen. First of all, you're being kind of a dick. He will assert. But you but, did hit him with the first. It's you're nice. the one that attacked us. Yeah. Plus, this one doesn't speak. It just sort of mimes at you. He wiggles. Kiri will grab her crotch and mime suck it. Resent it. I mean, we again. saw what happens when you tell that to Kiri. She can't help yeah. herself. She just can't fucking help herself. Although she will win a boss fight for you if she does that. Diana. All right. Let's see here. Who should I go for? So is this difficult terrain outside the? Yep, and the where it, where it's sloshy, it's difficult. Yeah, makes sense. Weirdly, the ground around here is not supremely open. even. I think I'll walk up and hit the bit and hit the main knight up here. The one. I don't know how main he really is, but I'm still gonna attack him. Uh, bo bonus action. Uh, uh, mirror him. Or no, I know that's regular action. Oh, actually, I'm just gonna be up here. Just gonna do some stabbing. I can't. I just did, I just did my regular action. My standard action was... So that's it, actually. Okie dokie. You move up, you do a thing. Ariel. Okay. Uh, so the water here is difficult terrain? Yep, yep. Okay, then. Let's see. So that would be 10, 15, 20. Mm -hmm. Okay, well... 10, 15, 20, 30. I'm going to come to Bob's side and help try and defend him against these armors. So, bonus action, hex this guy. Sure. Targeting what stat? Um, I'm going to say probably athletics, given that they're mimics and going to try and uh, grapple us. So, strength? Sure. I'll use that using one of my warlock slots for now, since I can get those back on a short rest. And then I'm going to blast them twice. Okie pokey. Uh, let me make sure. I don't have bless. Do the thing, is warlock. <laughs> I am doing the thing. Just making sure I have all my modifiers ticked on. Yep. Blap, blap. Uh, hit and a miss. That's a good thing that second one missed. It was piss poor damage. You just didn't want to shame yourself with how terrible it was. Exactly. Right. First one is a resounding hit. Good to Jerob. And the first one not to crit fail on their turn. <laughs> yeah, good job as well. Not crit failing. Bob. I'm just gonna... Dip. Dip. This bugger. Need a dex check, uh, save. Uh, which target? The one next to carry there? No. Oh, the furthest. Okay. Uh... There. 
Ah, damn, it doesn't have disadvantage on them because of armor. Nope. Damn it. Oh, well. With the armor. Bob. It comes at you. It ignores difficult terrain. It doesn't give a shit. Surprise, yeah. surprise. The Mimic's home. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Ignore difficult the, terrain. I don't know if you, also, you know anything about Mimic's at all, but they're made of sticky stuff. Yes, uh, they're both hit. Alrighty. You take 21... 35... 41 damage. Jesus. Uh, and that's his turn. And uh, this one is going to take a swing at Taji. Swing number one. Swing number two. I think both would be hits. Yeah, I will. Okay, yeah, let's see. First one hits a thing. Second one hits a thing. Alrighty. Two images pop. That was like... <laughs> oh yeah, Kiri thinks flanking still exists. Oh no. <laughs> uh, Hallie is going to... Heal wounds on Bob. Bonk. This totally normal armor is going to go try to tie up the bunny. 28 and a 24. Holy shit. Um, Where were these rolls yes, uh, last week? Uh... Well, I can't do anything about that first one. So that total damage would be what? That's 20, 34, 39, if I were to take it all. Let's go ahead and shield that second one. Okay. So I only take the first. All right. Uh, this one is going to swing up Fauna. Kia, Kia. 1712. Uh, no, and no. Alright, and this one's gonna swing at Hallie again. Those two both hit, though. Moo. Ouch. Wow. She's still standing. Uh, Jesse. Oh, goodness. This is going poorly. We, uh, seem to be getting our asses beat. Yeah. A little bit. At least that temp hit points, uh, so... Some of it. Yeah? Uh, how many temp is it these days? Thirteen. Yeah, still thirteen. Alright. Still very hurt. Uh, Jesse's gonna bonus action disengage. Swap to the Master Workshop bow and start using some fancy arrows because this is already going pretty poorly. And before double crit fail and shoot me. Oh no, it's a silver greatsword. That's real loud. Alrighty, 16. Yeah, no, they're really nice greatswords. It's a shame they're made of mimic juice. Bonra. Uh this my sword is stuck inside it. Like it's just sticking out. Yep. Can I just grab it and then just like try and cut it free? Uh give me an athletics test. Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> you son of a bitch. Owned. 
This armor has apparently been doing crunches. <laughs> yeah, Bob, a tie means the status quo remains the same, so no sword for Ponra. I'm getting my sword back. You watch this armor crunch. <laughs> just like, it like tightens up all their muscles. Or not muscles, <laughs> tentacles. Writhing okay, tentacles now, beneath the armor. I am, I am now recklessing. <laughs> okay. Oh. Bonk. Eat. And that's a crit, so that does yeah, extra damage. Double divine, and yeah. Sixteen more damage. Owie. And I'm Oof. just gonna lean I'll lean in and like give it back. Alright, ow. Big ow. Kiri. Alright, well, this is unfortunate. I will uh Take out my hand axe. You could also try an athletics test to recover yours. Uh, I don't know. I fucking saw that goddamn armor just style on Fauna, but all right, fine. Why did you talk me into this? Why'd you let yourself be talked into it? That was bait. <laughs> it's prime bait right there. Uh. <laughs> Hmm. Hook, line, and sinker. Uh, really you know was. what? I feel like you I should up your have sword. you. I feel like you should be bound by tentacles for that. <laughs> like just going fist deep into them. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Uh, the escape DC for that is fifteen, and you've still got a quote unquote extra attack. You can't escape with an attack, though. Yeah, but you can still just stand in his face and start just, just yeah, like slapping yeah, at him. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna hand axe him. I hand axe him a question. Chop. God, why, Scow? This is your stop. question was not particularly pointed. Um, I'm gonna gonna cast Shield of Faith on myself real quick. <laughs> yeah, yeah. This is not going fantastically for you, but I'm having a fucking treat right here. This is so it's so rare that things go like this for me. Well, enjoy it. Oh yeah, no, it's it's all oh. bets are off the moment you go into this dungeon. Uh Shadow Blade, third level. Okay. okay. And I'm gonna hit the one that Fawner's been hitting. Okay, okay. okay. Oh, not the best damage, but sh Ah, hey, it's still a hit. Yeah. Bonk. All right, Ariel. Okay. Uh, I'm going to use a bonus action to... Uh, heat up my knight's valor engine and create a spiritual weapon behind me to attack this guy. Okie dokie. So let me go ahead and roll that. I think that misses. And yep. then I'm going to swing twice at this guy. Okie dokie. And... Yeah. Yeah. Oh, uh, Perfect. Do the mimics count as shape changers? They do. Ah, then I need to roll another uh, 1d4 for both of those. Provide both of them hit. Yeah. Three extra damage. Right. Uh, minus a hex damage. I forgot to take that off. Sorry. Sure. Since 26. Yep. Let's go ahead and pop a smite on top of that. I feel it's getting to that point that we need it. Not a crit, not an undead or fiend. 20 extra damage. Woo! That's a spicy fucking smite. And that's all for me. All right. Bob. Okay, that's... I'm being like, I get smacked around. Okay. Fine. Uh, 
Under Armour. Okay. Um, don't think it takes any damage. I think it is just now very hot, unfortunately. Does so it have immunity to fire damage? damage? It doesn't have immunity to fire, but also it doesn't have flesh. <laughs> well, it's not in the same context. Tentacles. I guess. I guess then the real question is: Does it count as metal? Um, God, I'm now confused on how this should function on this creature. Yeah, because if their empty suit of armor is controlled by many tentacles, it'd be like, well, the metal I... will, will fuck you, roast you. The real I'm question, Scow, is whether is... the armor is actually metal or if it's just mimic goop. The armor is mimic. That's the problem. Then, yeah, it just doesn't work. Yeah. That's unfortunate. That said, their uh, their great swords, quote unquote, appear to be a metal. Well then, yeah. That's possible to shift over to that then. Um, seeing as that's such a weird case, yeah, I'll 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 let you have the gimme. Okay. Alright, it doesn't have to drop it. And so uh, I don't yeah. I don't think it will. But it will take six fire damage. Yeah, it passed the save. It has to hold, it can hold on to it. It just has disadvantage on attack rolls and ability checks to the start of your next turn. Its baseline yeah. attack is so garbage it is worth me it's swinging at you with disadvantage, frankly. Yeah, that is fair. Speaking of disadvantage, swing one. Disadvantage, swing yes. two. Oh, oh cock! For that. Oh, cock fuck! <laughs> All right. <sighs> it goes flying out of its grasp, uh, at which point you can see tendrils and goop split away from it. And it is made of silver, but it does appear to be just like a four or five foot pole made of silver. Solid silver, mind you. Nice. Mmm. Solid silver. A Sounds like we should to claim those. A pole of solid silver, indeed. We should claim those afterward if we survive. Like, grip pole an inch across? Uh, yeah, think, um, thinner, like a, a bit thinner than an exercise uh, weightlift bar made of silver. Damn. And Whoa. Taji. Swing, swing. Uh, those would, would both be hits. Yep. Well, the second one's going to hit. Actually, the second one I'm going to make disadvantage. Sure. Let's see if that first one hits the hits me or not. You better hope it hits the air mirror image. That's a lot of damage. It does not. It, it hits, hits you for 29. And a con save for your, uh, yeah, your concentration. Not DC 10 for yep. once. Yeah, I know. It's so rare that I ever do any fucking damage to you guys. Oh, damn it. Savagely de destroyed by armors. Halley is gonna. I'm too distracted by the mimics. Yep. Mass heal. Terrible roll. Sorry. Ask Goog, though. Puts me to full. And that will also give her some extra healing because of Blessed Healer. Uh, which is another five. And then as an action, holy shit. Uh, 
she's gonna take the dodge action. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. That's a that's a good plan. All right, this armor coming at you. Mm-hmm. Swing, swing. The hit, first miss. is a hit. The second is a miss. Thankfully, uh, that is twenty-six damage. Ouch. Fonra, swing, swing. Miss, miss. Wild. Uh, no. Oh, 16 hits. I was re I reckless. reckless remember. Oh, you're reckless, right? Bonk, bonk. So what's the uh, but yes, the, the, the totally normal damage is acid to damage. They have their mimics. Uh, 31 damage. Yeah. Actually, I think 29, because rounding down weird. Hmm. Yeah. Uh, anyway. Uh, who next? I'm going to do one swing on Kiri and still take a swing at Hallie. Even if she's dodging, it's probably worth trying to buff her. Makes yeah. sense. 20 on Kiri. Shield of Faith saves me. 23 on Hallie is a hit. Oof. She's still standing. I think she's going to have to use the Channel Divinity next turn. Like the double would the, heal. Would the Mimic have advantage on attacking Kirvan since she's bound up in its tentacles? Not unless I'm restrained. Just, no, if not I'm restrained. Just grappled, just, then no. You just grappled. Oh, okay. Uh, Jesse is gonna probably change targets and try and like actually take out the weakest target here. That's a good idea. Oh, it's a terrible idea. Oh, right, right in Curie's fat ass. Uh, one, two, three. All right, I'm gonna roll a d3. It could be any of you, you, uh, Bob or Fauna. So, 1d3, in the order. Carry Bob Fauna. Fauna, I'm so sorry. Uh, you take 4. Well, actually, you have to take the fire damage as well. You take 6 damage. Or, I guess, technically, no, you take 4 damage, because raging. You don't even notice it. It's a poke in the back. But... What? What about the, the sneak attack? The sneak and fire damage? She's not sneaking you, but you did take the fire. The 2 fire damage. Right, do you want to take the sneak attack damage from our rogue? Are you no. now her enemy? She wasn't targeting your weak spot, so she can't be sneak attacking you. She just unfortunately mm. hits you. <laughs> For her. Oh, it's my turn. It's like spicy hit you in the bum. I am going to once again reach for my sword. All right. Give All right, it. Give it back. Come on, Cray again, you fucking beast. Do it. Do it. Oh, oh no. Oh, okay, you were able to run. Oh, yeah, it's 24. Yeah, yeah. Meh. Yeah. You rip it free. It's been beaten down quite a lot now, and its consistency isn't together quite enough to hang on to Rage. it. Rage. <laughs> it's a good thing you were already reckless, like fucking swinging like an idiot. <laughs> Otherwise, that would have been. <laughs> I'd have just taken it back. I'm like, all right, thanks. So sad. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> just re healed it. Oh, fuck. 21. Drop set. Crumple, crumple. Alright, any movement or bonus? I will... Oh my god. Okay, uh... My priestess is getting her ass beat. Well, that's difficult terrain. The He's a barbarian. The spot she has enough. Uh, 10, 15, 20, 35. Yeah, he's fine. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, cool, cool. make it. Uh, Kiri. All right. You are grappled, your sword is stuck in this dude, and you're batting him very ineffectually with a hand axe. Uh, rather than beating at him ineffectually with a hand axe, uh, I think I'm just going to give Hallie uh, 
35 hit points with a lay on hands. Smart. Just grope the cow. Do it now. Meh. A little assistance would be appreciated. This fight has been embarrassing for all of us. Yeah, you're telling me. Saji. I lost my shadow blade. You did. First that never happened. What is it on Mimic Dungeon that has Taji off her game? He's too excited. Anyway, I still got a short sword. Yeah, a sword of shortening. Yeah. No. No luck. Ariel. Okay. It is time to focus down this thing. So I'm going to move my spiritual weapon over to my side here and uh, do my three whacks on this guy. Poke, poke. So, one, two... And spiritual weapon for third. Uh, I believe the spiritual weapon hits, maybe? Uh, it hits, yes. Alright, so the first one and spiritual weapon hit for 25 damage total. Cool. Uh, let's see where he's at, if I should smite or not. Yeah, he's not quite in smiting range yet. I don't know, if you roll as high as you did last time, he is. I don't trust it. I rolled a good smite once, but... Uh... <laughs> you don't, don't think it'll happen again? I don't think I'll roll another 20 right now. Not with the way things have been going. No. All right, Bob, you're up. Are you able to create bonfire? You're already um, concentrating on... Uh, heat That's metal. Sort of went out. That thing went out flying, and nobody's gonna. Nobody is picking it up. Gonna pick oh, it up. Oh, right. Yeah, true. Sure. Fair. It's just a red hot glowing rod sticking out of the fucking ground. It was honestly potentially worth it for him to go and try grab it, but uh, yeah, deck save again. Uh, he is now a step closer to that fucking great sword. Quote unquote great sword. And on his turn, he will happily cop an oppy off of Bob to go and grab it. Okay. Oh, nice. What kind of oppy does Bob have these days? Not a great one against someone as. <laughs> no! <laughs> Ponk. It does that thing like, have you ever seen someone uh, whack like tempered glass and it bounces back and hits him in the head? Whack bong! Uh, you take one whole damage. At least you didn't try and fist it. Otherwise, this is, I think fight, this a... is the fight of a thousand fails, and I'm, a, I'm just so here for it. Unfortunately, it's its entire action to reform the Silver Grave Sword, but it will do that because, again, being armed is worth far more. Yeah, that, that is fair. And Taji. Uh, let's see if that first one hits, because the second one is not. Uh, it doesn't, All right. doesn't hit. Mirror, okay, mirror hits image hits, pops. Mirror image, mirror image did, did put a lot of work in it. I think it saved you like a grand total of like fucking 60 something damage. Mm -hmm. Probably, yeah. All right, and Hallie's turn. Uh, panic mooing. Probably gonna do another one of those mass heals. Makes sense, yes. Yeah, yeah, that's fair. Let's see if I roll this one a bit better for you guys. No, I roll it identically shit. I mean, yeah, plus 11 is still hard. pretty good. Yep, it gets harder full. Thanks to a blessed healer. And as an action, 
Apparently the dodge action isn't doing shit for her. Uh, I know what she'll do. It's... <laughs> She's going to grab that fucking sword for you. Here you go. <laughs> Kiri, you are given back your sword. Oh, thank you. Much appreciated. <laughs> I was like, oh yeah, action economy is a thing. And it's, like, fucking mass healing word is amazing. A bonus action and then letting a, a healer just have a free action, not even if they don't feel like attacking. Like, they did their helpful thing. They can just do something else that's helpful. Yeah. Uh, Hallie is stonk. Alright. Fucking Ariel. Hit, miss. Right. First one is a hit, as usual. Second one's a miss. Can't do anything about the first one. That's a 28. So I take 20 damage. I go up. I go down. I go up. I go down. All right. Gary. Swing, swing. Uh, Well, that 27 is going to hit. Yep. Let me throw a concentration check at... Uh, too much weapon. Yeah, I'm good. And then 22 damage. Ouchie. Right. Bonus disengage. And let's shoot the one that Ariel's fighting. Hey! Oh, it's so close. Oh. So, so close. Oh, well. Maybe your spiritual weapon will finish it. Perhaps. Bonra. Uh... Reckless swing, swing. Oh, thank God. Good thing you're reckless. Stop touching my cow. Do it now. Uh, I'll watch your machine has started sealing stocks. 18. Alright. Do you want me to start adjusting the atoms in our favor? No. Let That's no, 25 altogether. Will. Oh, wait, no. 25. Uh, 25, 26, 10. 29. Yeah, with the 4 rage damage. Bonk. A resounding double bonk. Gary. Alright, I have my sword back. Time to strike. Never mind. I don't think it is time to strike. It's an awkward <laughs> position, you know? You're being grappled by this thing. It's it's grabbing at you. You're <laughs> trying to pull yourself free. And so you think, you know, the downward, the downward like, two-handed greatsword grip. How has that ever failed anyone? You basically just sheathe it in him <laughs> to, like, a non-harmful part. <laughs> Clamps down on you again. Yeah. <laughs> Bonk. Nothing. <laughs> Taji, you're up. Alright. Oh, I can try this again. No! Oh, bonk. Nice. That's what we like to see. There we 19 go. 19 uh, 25. Frank. Whoosh. Ariel. All right. So I realized something really stupid, and I what? know we can't go back on it. I forgot to tick on Caliban's Fury for all those attacks earlier. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, oh no. well. B B so, uh... spir spiritual weapon, save me from this, please. Uh, I don't nope. think spiritual weapon hits. Okay. Caliban, first attack. Nope. That doesn't hit either. Second attack. Def God oh. damn it. Jesus. The night of a thousand fails. But hey, you know what? It's really simple. I don't have to have my sword lodged and I can just turn it off and back on. This is true. <laughs> this, the blade gets quote unquote. I don't even know that it gets stuck though, unfortunately. Um, yeah, roll me a D2. Okay. You don't want to. Yeah, okay. It's fine. It would get stuck and then you do the, the flicky flicky. 
If it were a two, off it would sail. Mm. Bob. Well, that's unfortunate. Let's try it. Alrighty. Landing to south on Ariel. It saves. 19. Would you be rolling that below a fucking 15? I don't know what's up with me. This is like I've I feel like I've I've been owed some like really solid rolls for a while now, and they're all finally coming all at once. Yeah, yeah, they are. Pretty much, yeah. All right, let's uh, let's let's bop carry, bonk bonk. Um, well, the first one will hit. All right, need a concentration yep. for shield of faith. And it is also 25 damage, and you're fine, though. Yep. Wow, these guys, solid assholes. <laughs> yeah. Swing, swing at Taji. Whoa! 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 Oh. Whoa okay. <laughs> All right. This how one, quickly this the tide turns. Needed, right? <laughs> you know what? Yeah, this one doesn't so much hyper as extend as he, like, fucking just flings his own arms off. <laughs> the, uh, the pole, the pole goes sailing. It is over here. Just fucking Tadju, yeets Tadju it. Tadju will just with his arms attached. Him. With his arms attached to it, still. Yeah, that makes it easier for Tadju to literally t pose. This is true. He stick poses at you. He's an L. Uh, let's see here. Hallie, Hallie. There's only Hallie. a flesh wound. Uh. Eh. Oh my god, Ariel, I'm so sorry. <laughs> she looked weird to me after this. Uh, yeah, yeah. Um, it's a miss god, anyway. She, she did not want to use a mass healing word. Well, uh, a regular healing word. Just, just yeah. regular heal. Yeah, yeah. So let's, does Arrow get either. stabbed in the ass? Nah, nine isn't going to hit. Nine is not going to be anywhere near. Uh, I have 10 health. Okay. That may have made the difference considering that thing's turn is next, and it's been doing like 20 damage to me per turn. Yeah, it's been doing pretty considerable damage. Uh, uh oh. Alright. Good luck. Okay. Uh, that Close. would hit, but um, I'm going to shield so I don't take 30 damage. Okay. I feel that's a. I feel that's pretty reasonable. Yeah. This is such a weird fight. It's it's such an ass beat frenzy, but at the same time, I'm really really gooning it on like the, <laughs> the like finishing blows here. Gary. Okay. Uh, oh no. no! Here are all of my failures. Okay, we're we're saved. Everybody's all right, you fine. are un you are ungrappled. It oh, fucking yeah. completely fluffs the shit out of that. Jesse uh, is gonna swap back to the soul knife just because she gets two tries. <laughs> eh! Hit. Uh, doesn't get the fire damage though. Uh, doesn't matter though. It kills this thing. And Beck, she's got an offhand throw. Just eh, take that. Never mind. Fawn round. Clay. I am going to use my first action to move. I think move Hallie away from this creature. I'm gonna push her back. Sure. So she's out of like attack range. So All she right. can move around to do whatever she wants now. That's it. And now I will uh, that's, attack. That's it. I'm afraid that, you know, interacting with characters is an action. But you have moved her. And she appreciates that move. Okay. Okay, well. Uh, I whack. There we go. Hey! You've, you hit him. 
I did, and I'm gonna fucking use this uh, to uh, give myself uh, 14 temp HP. All right, let's see your smite then. Yep. Do do do. do. First level, no, no. Extra 13. Not great, but hey, I'll take it. Hey. 13 and... extra damage to him and 14 temp HP for you. Probably quite important. And then a gentle bonk again. Ding. Tank. Taji. All right. It's just you and this fucking guy, mano a mano, and somehow it's it's gone like swiftly in your favor. Yeah. What the fuck is going it's on? Fucking crit in a row. Yeah. All right. Shit. Oh my god, okay, then. you heard that, that was my tummy doing the big grumbling. It was very hard to ball, yes. I'm, I'm not even losing damage here, it's amazing. That's just weird. Ariel. Alright, time to go up here and unload again on the target that I first originally hexed at the very beginning of this fight. So first up, spiritual weapon. Fuck. Where are you at, spiritual weapon? There you are. Bonk. Huh. Okay. Bonk. Bonk. Uh, well, spiritual weapon did pretty good. Yeah, it doesn't get the fury, but that was only one. But also, spiritual weapon crit, so uh, that's pretty good. Uh, that's actually 6 plus 12 plus 1. Yeah, sorry. When I have them both ticked on, it just makes it easier for the two swings. Yep, yep. Owie, unfortunately, your Caliban swings did not follow through. But hey. Yeah, it's, it's readjusting right now. As it has you, trade, to, like, you traded for a crit. Yeah, it's readjusting as like I just turned it off and on. And it has to warm up for a minute. <laughs> Factory reset. Bob. Sure. Make that dex check. Nope. Continue to be dabbed on. Tell me no. Alright, after this fight, I'm gonna quickly, like, make a sandwich or something. Jesus. Alright, uh... Let's... Swap off of Kiri and try and knock down Ariel. Woo! You are crit, which means you are grappled. Uh, does the first one hit you? Ariel. Uh, oh, she's muted. Uh, sorry. I'm using Caliban's ability on the first one, so it makes it into a miss. Okay. The second so, one hits me, though. 34. You are still standing. Oh, just barely. Ouch. Big and ouch. grappled. Yep, and you are grappled. Eh, yeah, gravel doesn't really mean that much. No, nah, not really. Padgy. Oh, wait, no, he doesn't have attacks to make. Never mind. Um, uh, you can oppy him and he will run over here, grab his weapon. His Well, he grabs his arms. He presses his whole torso into his arms. <laughs> and that's his turn. But uh, yeah, Taji, if you'd like to GFB him, I'm pretty sure you're a warcaster, so you can just bop him with your... Counter-ups. I am not. I don't. Oh, okay. Still eight damage. Still hit him though. Yeah, this guy is still taking a considerable ass kicking from you. I'm so used to Shadow Blade that it doesn't really matter if I green flame or not. Yeah. All right. My oppies are usually pretty scary. Time to Child of Any, I think. I'll take one of them down. It's like 40 hit points worth of channel. How much to get Ariel to half health? Uh, 26, because I just did the math there to get one half. Does anyone else have less than half? Oh, wildly enough. Doesn't look like nope. it. Wild. Uh, hold on one second. Let me check real quick. No. No, okay. <laughs> I'm in mix too. <laughs> That's true, you could she could pick up some mimics if she feels bad about them. No, she doesn't feel bad about the mimics. 
Yeah, fuck mimics. All my homies hate mimics. Except that's not true. Honestly, I probably should have casted Cure Wounds if you were the only one hurt. Oh well. Oh, well, she gets channeled Divinity's back, like, fairly easy, I think. No, you don't. No, nope. you don't. Short rest. Everything a cleric does is long rest. No, nope. channel uh, Divinity's are short, short rest. rest. Oh. Yeah, channel Divinity's are short rest. Oh. Yeah. Um, yeah, see, channel Divinity's are easy. She just gave me 26 hit points for free because we're doing a short rest after this. Oh, yep. Okay. Uh, that's... This armor is kaput. Uh, Kiri. Your fucking greatest foe. I think that's one hit. 29. Uh, yeah, that is. is one. Ugh, this is starting to really fucking hurt. Jesus. Yeah, tell me about it. Welcome to the not even the first room. Uh, you, know, you, should definitely, you should definitely move up this turn uh, when it's your turn so we have a flank train. Yeah, obviously, yeah, they think it's... I love the idea that Kiri just still thinks that flanking exists, because she was fighting in 4e for so long. Uh, let's go over here, and... Uh, let's, let's swap back to the bow again for another fucking fire arrow. Bonk. Dead. Huh, thank you. <sighs> yeah. Bonra. So once more, Kiri can reclaim her weapon yep. from the puddle of goo. I will continue to recklessly strike. Uh, hit and a miss. Nineteen, twenty-one, twenty-three. Gary! I would have thought you would have liked tentacles, Ariel. <sighs> Can't function without bless. Guess not. Oh well. Tadji! Oh, well. oh wait, hold on. Uh, clearly, uh, right. I know why this didn't work here, wasn't flanking. <laughs> you needed to say yeah, yeah. were flanking. You oh, were that's already right. flanking. Ariel was there. Yeah. Oh, that's right. Yeah, yeah. Stuff. So no, I'll, I'll move up here so Hallie can move in. We can get a double flank train. Yeah, of course. Of course, of course. Yep. Kaji, what do? Yeah, I'm gonna... He's gonna continue your, your pitched singular combat against this dude? Oh no, you oh, coward! You're breaking the duel! That night well, yeah, what is well. it to you as you leave? Is that hit? On who? The, the, it doesn't hit, The though. mimic... Ariel. All right. Again, don't fail me this time. Here we go. One, two. Oh. <laughs> well, off Buckle and on it goes, it goes. I'll do this time. And then spiritual weapon. Ah. Oh. Well, the first one hits, maybe. Yeah. Yeah, the first one hit. So that does 18. Mm-hmm. Oh, he's right there. I, um, that's... Uh, Let's spend a smite. I can get a smite back of Channel Divinity anyway, so might as well try and put him down. Go on, lowball it. Give me them ones. Twelve. No, okay, he's down. <laughs> oh, goodness. Bob. There's one glorious warrior left. Okay. Totally normal armor. Finally gets hit by a bonfire. Bear in mind, this whole time I've been rolling plus two dexes, and I've just been just juking them every time. Uh... Alright, that's 30 feet exactly. Hi. Damn that, I thought it was 35. <laughs> Shit. Oh, I crit you, and then I fucking fling his sword away. <laughs> <laughs> Ouch. You take 46 damage, and then... And that drops you. We'll go down and exactly. 
And then he swings like through the over. Then he swings through the air. And he swings so fucking hard his arms fall off again. And you guys can thusly and rightfully dispatch with him. Hallie's turn is right after and she will pick you up. Dark Souls PvP him. Let's go. Yeah. Uh, and then she'll just The other channel divinity. Um yeah, might as well. Yeah, you get them back. How much to get you to half? 22, yeah, which but... means yeah. she's still got 18 left to spare. Who else needs it for their halfies? Uh, Probably uh, Kierwin. Kierwin. Yeah. What was it, 18 All right. left? Yep. Perfect. That gets me uh, pretty much exactly. I think a little bit over. You can't go over half. Yeah, I know. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. I think that leaves two hit points. Uh, uh, that leaves okay. seven hit points. Seven hit points. Uh, Errol, you can go up to half as well, and I think that's it. I haven't gone below ha uh, half. Okay. I'm at half. All right, never mind then. <sighs> uh, yeah. And then you can dispatch of this lad. That was unnecessarily taxing. I think they were yeah. quite upset that they didn't get to do their routine. As you say that, the chest over here speaks. Didn't get to do our routine? What do you mean? You're already in the dungeon! <laughs> and the floor reaches up and swallows all of you. Great. Oh, that's really bad, because we still don't have the oil of freedom on us yet. Yay! I'm just slide you over here while I do, so, do a little bit of prep and grab you. Yeah, I didn't feel bad about them solid silver bars because I was like, what are the odds that they grab them before stage two starts? <laughs> yeah. Now, Tiara, I believe, was flying, so she doesn't. she's not in range when the floor reaches up and swallows you all. Probably. So she does watch you all get swallowed, which is uh... tragic. And that's how Tiara got a war fetish. Oh, no. Oh, no. no. Now we got to put her down. And allow that to exist here. No vor, no ever. And the entirety of your party tumbles out of an open doorway into a room that appears to be richly appointed stone, wooden walkways, and bookcases that still smell of like musty old literature. There is a great big desk next to a warm, inviting lantern and a series of journals and wills and an unearthly silence. When you look behind you at this, what appears to be an open doorway leading to bright, sunny, just like warmth and light, you realize that it's a Looney Tunes-esque painted on picture scape of the outside world. A solid surface meets your touch. Oh, joy. What that is this? This is fantastic. And there it was, my secret joy. When you were like, this is too fucking obvious. I was like, oh no, they already realized the trap. You're just a mimic. I was like, oh, they're, they're dumb. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> They've already walked in and they didn't even realize it. <laughs> it was perfect. It was good I mean, how, can, we, we, how would we be able to tell that we already walked into it when it's a little swamp area? Exactly, but that's why I thought that you would be like, we should move, this is the, this is the trap, and you didn't, you just were like, alright, Avant. Well, <laughs> it was perfect. Well, one of us Avanted, and that sort of spurred the rest. Oh, it was so good. But yeah, what Yeah, do you I should have realized that when the armor springed out of nothing. Alright, let's not Sprung. just go wildly chasing into it, let's get our bearings. Do what prep we can and see about regaining some of ourselves before going forward. Uh, yeah, I'll hand, hand out the oil to anyone who doesn't have it already. Yeah, provided we are able to, I think we're taking a short rest and trying to get back resources. Um, are you going to short rest then oil or oil then short rest? It looks like Bob is oiling up already. Uh, oil. Can we not oil while we short rest? Weird. Okay. The short rest 
takes an hour. So let's go ahead. If we what? do that, then we lose out on an hour of oil. Yeah. All right, yeah. Let's short rest first. Yeah, we'll we'll try and short rest first, then oil up. Perfect, 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 perfect. So, you guys have your short rest. Feel free to fill up all of your um, uh, various health bars, etc. Sixteen. Forty-eight. Fifty-nine. I will have to do for now. Okay, and you will have thirteen temp HP again. Okay. Having a CD is back. Okay. So, as your short rest finishes, you find that you are all stuck to the ground. Mm hmm. And that's it why we're gonna. Be a solid stone floor. In fact, apart from Bob, Bob very specifically did oil up fast. That's why we're gonna oil up now. Yep. See here. Okay, and then yeah, once you are oiled up, you're able to peel yourselves off of the ground. Although each of you takes, who again was resting on the floor, each of you does take one whole acid damage. That was a terrible. All right, yeah, short rest is worth it before oiling. Yep. Yep. Yeah. Not much a punishment. <sighs> well. Now that the necessities are out of the way, what is this place? Looks like a library. Uh, well, say yeah, that's what it looks, looks like, like, but... Yeah, well, looks like one that looks probably like. isn't. Yeah, the... Well, I assume it looks like a lot of things, but it's... This whole place, this entire dungeon, is a mimic. Well, yes, but no. why would the Mimic bother making its insides look like something? As you approach the front desk, the front desk and the chair both speak up at once. Oh, look, visitors, you're not dead. Well, hey, visitors, they aren't dead. Yes, we're the visitors, and we're not dead. Yes, we're not dead. Thank goodness. Oh, have fun getting comfortable, food. Mm. Feel free to peruse the library as you are slowly consumed. Why do you have a library inside you, if you don't mind my asking? I don't know any use mimics. Uh, I Diana. believe that one is, yes. Wait, raise his hand. Oh, well, okay. I can tell her, but for the rest of you, none of your fucking business. Hey, what's up, sweet cheeks? Come <laughs> over here. Let's say hello. <laughs> <laughs> Tana's just grinning ear to ear, like, literally. Now look at them perfect little chompers. Aren't you a precious little kitten? All right. So you wants to know about the library, do you? Yeah. What's Where going did you on brought here? all your food you in here with you, too, but, eh, well, yeah, I'm not one to judge. They're emergency food. Ah, that makes sense. Yeah, fair. Uh, apologies, though. It looks like we're probably going to end up snacking down on them, albeit unintentionally. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Well, uh, yeah. So what are you here for? Business or pleasure? Uh, both, really. Ah, I see. What's going on here? All right. You got your identification? Uh, let's see. I don't... Identification? 
Ah, I see. Nah, you're a foreigner. I see how it is. It's fine, it's fine. Yeah. Uh, we have some guest forms you can fill out here. One second. Uh, the uh, desk will go, oh, uh, here, I have some. And at which point a piece of paper and a quill is pushed up to the surface of his desk. <laughs> All right. It's a working visa for the council. You know how it goes. Yeah. Yeah, the mimic council, yes. <laughs> yeah, Bo. Take the quill yeah. and... Yep, you can write that out. Yep. All right, all right. Uh, it looks like you put down night as occupation. Weird for a mimic, but I'm not here to judge. Okay, let's have a look here. Uh... Particularly sign it, lady. Let's see. Yeah. All right, all right. That's pretty much fair. Uh, here, have a guest pass. At which point, uh, the uh, chair's arm just like reaches into a shelf and then pulls out what appears to be a wooden plaque. Yeah. But anyway, uh, this here is the amphitheater, or it's. It was an amphitheater, and then it was a library. It was also at one point an oculary, but... Uh, our attachment to the stars obviously ain't what it used to be. Ah, okay. So, Tayana, what are you hoping to find here? I don't know, I'm looking to explore. Uh, should I have updated you to a tourist visa instead of a guest pass? Uh, maybe, yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, it'll take me a couple minutes to get that filed out for you. Why don't you entertain yourselves for then? Are the all books right. all, the I'll books are what's... also mimics, aren't they? Yes. Oh, probably, but... Do, do they mind if we read them? I don't want to see... Uh, some of them don't have subjects in them, but a lot of them do. Go for it. We are a repository titles. of knowledge. You make sure your emergency food stays out of trouble, though, Lady Tyana. Of course. Of course. Yeah, I just yeah. want to read what titles we got here. Uh, when you look upon the books, uh, this row here appears to be, like, as we would know it, like high fantasy adventure novels. Here they're called adventure novels. Of course, of course. Uh, let's see here. One of the ones that you pluck up appears to uh, describe the early events of Save D1. I'll just uh, make sure the mimics are sm are spelling everything properly. Yeah, their the, the spelling is impeccable. Good, 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 good. <laughs> <laughs> yep. <laughs> yeah, Kiri opens a book and instead of fist holding a Glock, starts <laughs> is just staring her in the face, slowly shut the book again. <laughs> oh no. This book's got a gun. What's a gun? <laughs> but yeah. As you aren't rummaging around, the stacks can see that you a, a book is like sorry, a chair is filling out paperwork. Uh -huh. It's so surreal, and I love it. So, what topics are like these two shelves? Um, they could be anything. Oh, uh, give me a D ten. Okay. Do you want me to give you two since it's two different stacks? Um, uh, they're probably both the same. Um, subject matter. Yeah, they're probably both the same aisle. Uh, let's see here. Geography. Unfortunately, the geography is completely alien to you. Um, which is not completely alien. You've had enough references. It appears to be, uh, 
like the geographical changes and alterations in structures for uh, Elysia. Damn, we could have had an actual good map here for our uh, continent, since it's geography. Yeah. Carrie, you walk up to this uh, ocularry device and you can see that it is... It looks like it has rusted completely solid, but obviously when it opens its eyes, and that is to say one of these rings has eyes, that it is all one mimic and the rust is for show. Hello. Ooh, what's up? Can I spin you? Uh, I don't spin no more, otherwise I'll lose everyone's positions. Who's everyone? Uh, fuck, have you got identification or a gas pass? Kiri will point down. I'm with her, she does. Oh, uh, it's the planes. You know, fire, water, air. Earth. Uh, oh, okay. They're the Ceresians, the Onans, the Lesans, the Abyssals, oh, wow. the Astrals. The mimics keep track of that sort of stuff, huh? Oh, yeah, sure. So not even, like, one little spin? Mm, no. No spinning. Yeah, I'd rather you just didn't touch anything. The planes haven't moved in a very long time. Was there a time when they did move? Sure. Long, long time ago. Well, if they're not moving anymore, then you're not likely to lose track of where they are. Please, I have these things exact to an incredible degree, and it took me maybe 500 years to get them perfect. Here he just does, here. like, the biggest sad puppy face. I'll Five put my hand on his shoulder. Ma'am. <laughs> Why don't you spin the one over there? <laughs> what is that one keeping track of? That one tracks a place called the Dreams, and those are in flux. Of course, they're not around here, so we can't track them anyway. Might as well fucking spin them. Okay. <laughs> Hi. Hi. What's up? Can I spin you? Go for it. Yay. Yeah, as you uh, push on one of these wheels, this great thing heaves and creaks for a moment before, like, oily smooth, it begins to spin and glisten and shine. And you can see each of these orbs on the outer circuit appear to represent, as we would know them, the Aeonan gods, as you would know them, probably none of them. Maybe the Morrigan. So, not to be rude, but why are you surrounded by anal beads? Um, because the dreams are represented as spheres. What's a dream? Some big beads. What do you think a dream is? Well, I mean, obviously dreams are a thing, but these are all n named. Uh, um, I'm sorry, I don't think you're authorized to know. Well, who can authorize us? Uh, councilman in office, I think. Mm, can we go see him then? Um, maybe if you have a visa. Gary will point at Paggy. Oh, uh, you should define the stairs down then. Mm. They're here somewhere. Good thing I'm already looking out for those stairs down, then. Yeah, why don't you give me an investigate check? Yeah. Okay. I'll throw one out. In investigate. Oh. Mm. It's not perception? Nope. No, we're looking We're looking hard. Okay. Wow. Yeah, I got enough. 15. That's weird. The coloration of this whole building just changed. Yeah? Uh... Oh, and now it's normal again. The fuck was that? I can't tell if this guy was being in <laughs> character or not. <laughs> I don't know. No, that was that was that was that was real life me. I was just like, wait a fucking second. Like everything went pale gray and then went away again. God damn mimics. I, 
I can tell mm, that's what you're my doing screen that. is cast. I thought, I thought it was tied with the investigation checks, and you were just being silly. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. No, no, that was me because I'm checking oh, the radius click the... of. Uh... Yes. You, you you turn on an aura, right? Okay. Yes, I was seeing how far 120 feet by my fucking vision thing goes, seeing yeah. invisible and hidden thing. Yeah, so I have a funny story for you, Bob, once you start concentrating on your surroundings in that same way, you know, leaning into your extra magical perceptions. Uh, remind me, can you see into the astral plane? They're ethereal, so I don't know if you separate them. I don't know that you can see into the astral. Let me read the robot. So the, the astral plane is the plane of the gods, not like an overlaid plane. You might be thinking yeah. ethereal. I might be thinking of ethereal then. Okay. Yes. It's weird because there is there is a bunch of writing for this place that is astral quite on purpose. But I think in the ethereal as well. Sure. Uh you know when there is a um like uh, looking at a 3D movie without the glasses on, and it's got that uh, red-green afterimage on the other side of it. Yeah, the separation. Yeah, but you can see that separation in this place. This whole building, quote-unquote, is ethereally the exact same shape. It is a mirror, one-to-one. -one. Interesting. A little bit dis disorienting, but takes a second or two to get used to. It, um, it probably is something you could get used to, but right now it's definitely throwing you off a little bit. Um, just like your perception of things isn't in quite the same place, but like even the mimics, like the separated mimics, like these books, these chairs, this table, they all appear to be ethereally in the exact same place. And when you look in Tayana's direction, she too is ethereally in the same place. The rest of you all look like solid image in like a slightly blur edge location. But T Taji and every mimic here is being completely mirrored in the ethereal. Huh. In her element, that is moisturized. Interesting. That is very interesting. That would explain why I just turned to the table and chair. Sorry, the desk and chair. Just that would explain the whole separation and longevity. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry there, little sir or ma'am. I don't follow. Well, you are tied to the ethereal plane, aren't you? No, the ethereal plane is tied to us. Don't be weird. Yeah. <laughs> that, that's so here back and forth. With... So now the question is, why is the ethereal plane tied to us? Well, obviously, it's because we're important. The most important. The ethereal plane doesn't give a shit about people who aren't important. Beams with pride. Yeah. Oh, but hey, you, you guessed you guessed Visa is done. Oh, perfect. The chair's arms will stretch slowly out towards you with a creak, and it will slap a metal panel into your hand. It says guest on it in an incomprehensible language that every one of you recognize as still saying the word guest on it. <laughs> awesome, thank you. You're welcome. Have a nice day. You too. You should ask it where the stairs are for the councilman. You. Okay, yeah. That is a good question. Where are the stairs? They're on this ground floor, but uh, nah, I'm afraid they like to have their little games. Or like to have their little of games. Course. I don't know. Ain't been down there in a while. The stairs are here somewhere. Ah, uh, they like to move around. Of course. Yep, yep. And of course, the stairs oh. are slightly. Slightly smaller on observation to lead to larger rooms on the inside, of course. Oh, yeah. Uh, standard mimic stuff. Yep. 
So the stairs yes, could be not... anywhere. On this anywhere, ground floor, right. at the very least. Yeah. Uh, yes, give me a little bit. This, but... I'll see if I can just actually see them. If they try to hide and shit. I suppose our investigations were not enough to find them. Nope. Also, Fauna, when you walk over there, the little telescope goes, Psst, hey, hey, you, look through me. Look through me with those delicious looking eyes. You're going to have to be a... Uh, I like to keep my eye, thank you very much. Oh, okay. Well, you don't need both of them, do you? Come on, they're delicious. No, I'm going to keep both of my eyes. Ah, boo. But... If you do, I will tell you where the stairs are. Feed oh. me an eye. I'm not going to feed you one of my eyes. But I will. F I can feed you, if you like. Yeah, you if got you me eyes. About gold. No, I don't have any eyes. You, like, uh, you just like to eat eyes? Yeah, eyes. They're my favorite. Oh. Hmm. Okay. Hey, Bob. <laughs> oh, your friend over there looks like he's made of eyes. He'd be delicious. And it just all eyes just refocuses on her like... Oh, yeah. look at you. You're like a delicious little snacklet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we don't still have any great beast eyes, do we? No, I was just oh, looking no, for I that. I don't them. believe we do. I, no, they're, I use they're them all for the road. Yeah. Oh, that's unfortunate. I just look at Tayana. I just, I just look at Tayana and say, "I still have fucking moonbeams." So no. Oh well, rude. Sometimes food is so rude. Oh well. I know. I'm sorry. And I'll I'll pat the telescope. The telescope pairs. Uh, that's. <laughs> uh, that's Let's see if I can see where the fuck, where the fuck that little fuck is trying to hide. Yeah, give me an investigate of your own, Bob. Yes, please, Bob. Oh, my investigation actually hot garbage. Yeah, good luck. Yeah. <laughs> so thinking, like I said, see, but just for the uh, difference. Could any of us try and help you? Has someone not done an investigation that can help you? Uh, Hallie. Actually, why are we having you investigate? Why don't we have the rogue who's probably trained in investigation do an investigation? Assist her, and she gets. She like looks at, looks up from a book. Uh, oh, fine, sure. We are working on somewhat of a time limit. Yeah, I saw the table over there whisper amongst itself and giggle when you were talking about eyes. All right then. And yeah, oh, uh, hiding it? hiding beneath this table is in fact a staircase down. Oh hey, there you are. Oh shucks, they found me. <laughs> Kiri, okay, that globe looks... there, you do not recognize the landscape at all. Where are you supposed to be? That's a secret. Oh, come on, you can tell me. I'm going to get digested anyway. Mm, no, some bleep people can escape, so no. Can't tell. Aw, come on, give me a hint. I'll spin you real uh, good. It's... Mm, your great ancestors came from here. Oh. Kiri will grin and then... Yes, yeah, you will give him a big two-handed spinner. Ah, uh, we. And the voice does the um, wee. like voice of yeah, vo the voice into a fan wee. thing. Yeah. <laughs> we. Uh, I like this. I place. just want to say, I love it too. <laughs> Everyone here is so adorable. If only they weren't trying to all eat us. Yeah. Yes, adorable is. A word for it, I suppose. Oh, come on. They're still so cute. I'm pretty... not fond of things trying to eat me in the sense that they are. Ah, sounds like you're kink shaming. 
Oh, well, here's the stairs. The table will open its flap up entirely like a fucking cellar door. Have fun. All right. Yep, you you guys all, you all make, make a big shout. You also have a good day. The entire library goes, good luck. Bang. All right, let me. I guess I'll take point and head down the stairs. Yeah. (laughs) All righty then. Grab all the tokes. Eh, 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 eh. As you walk your way down the stairs, they change shape quite readily. Until you find yourself in what appears to be some abandoned drawing room, perhaps? Like a scribium? Oh! Oh, I see a giant statue at the bottom. What is... what is that? Another mimic, probably. Well, I mean, yes, another mimic, most likely, but I mean, what is a statue of? Uh, it appears to be of a human woman with long hair. All right. There is an easy smile on their face, and stone hands seem to jut from the floor uh, beneath this human woman's chi- like chin, jaw, like maybe going into the neck itself, is another doorway. Oh, we just found our... Cover her hands and shout, You're really pretty! Oh, uh... Thanks. A- appreciated. The mm-hmm. statue head will announce... Oh, um, watch out, by the way. Who? Uh, oh, I was about to ask who are you a statue of, but uh, I suppose we have to deal with this first. Oh, the drawing table's about to attack us. Yeah. Uh, just grab the Arathan. <laughs> yep. Oh, <God. laughs> the deck, the deck, you mimic. That's a lot of things to go against. It is, isn't it? Yeah, you're a lot of boys. They announce party! Party! (laughs) And we don't have something that can cast fireball right now. Oh, I don't want to do that. <laughs> I do. I want a fireball to take care of, like, a good portion They're of this room. quite well spread out, though, admittedly. Yeah, admittedly. Yeah. Three, six, nine, twelve. There's well, twelve of these you things. Get nine of them in one good fireball blast. Yeah. Yeah, so, but... Uh, it's no, a shame I, I go last. Out of the way, yeah. And, of course... I mean, they might guys... be more grouped up by then for you to do fireball. Yeah, yeah, unfortunately, the acid damage might not be great. Oh my god, their names. <laughs> the wow. killer mimic <laughs> and you fucking what, mate? <laughs> I love them. I have no idea what you're talking about. Mm-hmm. And we... Okay. Yeah. Wouldn't it be crazy if, like, the lore for like your great ancestors of the teeth like the doggo curse coming here somehow reverse back to Mira from artifacts from artifacts that would be a step wouldn't it be crazy though could be alright Jesse is gonna step up but wait no why would you step up, step up? stepping up is crazy uh, she is going to ready an action, though, when one of you are adjacent to a pillar, she'll shoot it. Oh, good. Ariel. I'm next to the pillar. Shoot it. All right. Uh, and you know what? She is probably going to... She hasn't got many fire arrows left. She's going to swap to necro arrows and fire more of them. Uh, it's just... Necro. Not Becry. Necro. Hit. Alright, continue. Alright. Uh I'm just gonna swing at it twice. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Uh Ooh. I mean 
Off and on again. Miss and miss. Yeah. You now have, uh, I think, eight minutes of Blade left? Yeah, the start of this fight, I have eight minutes of a Blade left since I'm turning it on. Okay. I'm keeping track of that. I got I got on my sheets, Gal. And then, Fauna, a fucking unit, like, punches its way out of the rubble. Ugh. Oh, you're a big boy. <laughs> big VE fists sneak out from flaps at the side of a mimic, and orange eyes watch you as it crunches its fists together, making knuckles pop. Wham! Wham! Ow! I'm not, he I'm fucking not, has at you! I'm not raging yet. And now it's your guy. And now I'm gonna rage. And what's got you troubled? Uh, when you ask that, he starts pumping his fists in the air. Ooga chugga, ooga chugga. Oh no, he's he's just fight sexual. Got it. Feeling. A deep inside of me. I feel like I... Girl, you got to know what you do to me. I don't want to use my claymore against these things. These things aren't beasts of darkness or undead. They're just mimics. I mean, in one sense, a mimic is a beast of darkness, considering is all it? the havoc and, re and destruction it brings. Are they, They're though? clearly not beasts of darkness. Yeah. These are just cutie booties. Yeah, these are friends. They, This guy just wants a tumble. All righty. Missing a hit. Bonk. Uh, 9.15. They are the ladder mimic art. But they were like the tallest mimic I had. All right. Pillar mimics. These shot will be disadvantaged against Fauna. Pew! 16? No. Okay. Takes one damage because he literally shoots a brick out of himself. Oh, friends, don't hurt yourselves. Uh, this one will... It's not disadvantaged. It will shoot at Kiri. Pew! Ugh! Bonk. Didn't you just say disadvantage? No, with not no, not oh, range. These obvious. things, yeah, yeah, yeah. These things are twenty forty. Yeah, he's right. He's right there. Thirty sixty. Where are they? Yes, thirty sixty. How? She's fitting. And then another large boy stomps out of the fucking chests, boxes, and crates, and is just going to full body charge all the way up here. Luckily, you're not in 4E, so it doesn't hit you. You're surprised, like, why would you double move instead of charge attack me? I don't know what you're talking about. What is this charge attack? That <laughs> fell out of fashion years ago. <laughs> Fauna. <laughs> Pew! Brick. Uh, is it a 20 or a 16? Yeah, 20. Okay, that does hit. All right, Hallie, let's let's do some um, ability efficiency at the start here. And because you guys seem to desperately need it. Second level bless. Yeah. Oh, thank God. Oh, thank God. Uh, go with as well, Taji and Fauna. There you go. You four. Enjoy your blesses. You fucking desperately need them. I do. I so fairly do. I just need to roll above a five. Diana. Friends, why are you hurting yourselves to attack Buddy! <laughs> Great. Okay. They're just, they're just dumb. Got it. We're a dungeon. <laughs> yeah. Okay, fair. 
I'm still gonna walk up to the the boy. I thought this the was lad. a li- I thought this was a library. Well, upstairs was a library. Now we're in a dungeon. Sorry, just do anything. Uh, yeah. okay, yeah. Yeah, it hits, uh, ten people there, saving. Because that one guy's just barely out of it. <laughs> Floor four sometimes. Okay, let's see. I, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, again, uh, mirror image this. And I think it this point let's see yeah i can have more i think i can have more spell slots than i have uh than i normally have right if i convert a sorcery point to a spell slot you is a at a cost but yeah you can convert sorcery points to spell slots even if i'm like full on them i'm just wondering how that works uh there's a chart there's a yeah, there is a chart. I'm just wondering if I can have more more first level spells than spell slot, more first level spell slots than. No, you can't yeah. have more than what you have. Okay, then I'll just wait. I'm pretty sure you can't have more than what you have. All right, brick shot, Fauna. Pew. Damn it. Uh, let's make all three of these on carry. Leave me alone. <laughs> There's Rick. so many going at once. Fucking Matrix dodge. Wow. Minus three. Even the 22? Minus one. That wasn't against me. Oh, was it not against you? No. I thought they were all against you. Minus three. No, it was the last three. Uh, this one... Can reach you, Carrie, with a pseudopod. Or miss. And this one, Fauna, a pseudopod. Miss. And this one, Fauna, a pseudopod. Miss. And this one, Brick. Oh, God. Disadvantage Brick shot a Carrie. Nope. 19? No. Darn. These poor boys. And this one, disadvantage brick shot fauna. Fourteen now. Bob. That is quite sucky time to be. So, uh, this, gonna, this is some PTSD moment for, uh, for some people, but uh, I will just give it a step back, reach up a hand, and just finger snap. Moonbeam chant. Oh no, Moonbeam Chan. Uh, it's no longer PTSD at this point. We're just used to it. Yes, but these are all shape changers. This is true? Mm hmm. Uh, 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 uh. I shall go grab us a Moonbeam Chan. Controlled by Hedra. There you go. Thank you. What is it? Con? Con. Yes. Disadvantaged. Yep. All right. You fucking what, mate? Does its con? 
Pelimimic con. Wow, oh, shame of disadvantage there. 15 damage on the Pelimimic. And what might that up to? A 15 hit, uh, doesn't make it. What should you say? Oh, 16. Yeah, it's a 16 right there. Are we? By one. And it's a massive ass cylinder, so. Yeah. There's a fucker in the roof. He's not gonna be having a good time. Yeah, here's the thing. When you activate Moonbeam Chan, there is like a hissing and sizzling from the floor. That could be good. And the roof, I suppose. Kiri. All right. Kiri's going to start to fucking groove. I'm giving it indigestion yeah, now. Yeah, 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 yeah. And while she's doing so, she's going to spiritual weapon herself. And throw a fireball into the middle of the room. Woo! Spin around and huck another anal bead. Wait, can uh, uh, yeah, it's not like actually casting fire while using a bead to do it. Correct. Okay. I can't stop this feeling. <laughs> oh my fucking god! Uh, I'll I'll do the rolls and then you can print the damage because it's just gonna be disappearing a wall otherwise. Yep. Mm-hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh, looks like. Three, four Three. pass. Four pass. Four pass. Okay. Uh sixteen five pass. Yeah. You know, I'll make it the back the like the back four here. All right. Yeah, they're, damage. they're covered by All the right. flame and weather. I can't stop this feeling okay, so deep inside of me. Eleven. 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 Here's one, two. 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 So there's 20 foot range on these brick boys? Uh, 30, 60. Oh. Okay. Thanks. Nowhere I can get that's out of that guy's range. Yeah. Escaping their ranges would, would be like I suppose outside of the intention of the dungeon you'd have to be at the doorway to avoid even a couple yeah. of them. But that does mean I can move to like here without getting it. Yeah, you can and make a disadvantage at the very least. <laughs> okay. Grooves. That was a very worth fireball. Yeah. yeah. Like, how much damage have... does it technically do? Uh... Over 100, you did uh, 22 times 5 and then 11 times yeah. 4. And now I can delete that and off my character sheet because I'm out of those. Yeah. So that's 110, 121. No, wait. Yeah, 121, and then 11 times 4. 176 damage. Yeah, something like that. Brutal. <laughs> it's pretty good. Dance off, bro, come on. Yeah, starts fist pounding. Yeah. Alright, Jesse is gonna... Schust. Pew. Ah. She might have to go back to soul knifing just so that she can um, fish for the sneak attacks as opposed to getting arrows in. Yeah, that's Ariel. fair. Okay. All right. Whack. Whack. There we go. Hit, hit. Yeah. So uh, 15 and 12, so 27. Yeah. Uh, Simon, you said you did spiritual weapon? No, shield of faith. No, you said spiritual weapon, ah. but yeah, you ah. meant shield. Of you meant shield of faith when you said spiritual yeah. The sp weapon. the spell I actually have. All right, you fucking what mate's gonna come at ya? Pornra, bonk bonk, hit miss. You okay? Uh, okay, one second. Uh, so that's thirteen, seven, six. Uh, whack. Whack. Uh, let's see here. Uh, can you roll me your bless, please? Oh, let's not Oh, and, uh, can't say for you what mate as well. 
I already did it. Oh, right, yeah, no, yeah, because he's in the fire thing. He'll move out. Okay. Oh, 21. Is Moonbeam, is Moonbeam start of their turn or end of their turn, Hedra? If they, uh, uh, the first time they are in it, and if they end their turn in it. No, okay, so he only took the one and then he moved out because he's not an Egypt. Uh, that That's, does mean uh, that Taji gets an oppie. All right. I had another two too many. No, it's Tasha's turn. Sorry, it's Tasha's turn. I just checked that. Okay. Uh, in which case, I think he goes down no matter what. Weird starts and it does the damage. Like it feels weird that it does a double tick. The first time it enters in it and when it starts its turn there. It's all about timing. Okay. Are you not a war no, caster yeah, Tiana? That... No, I keep She's saying not... I'm not. Oh, okay. said not. But fortunately, that was dog shit damage, and so he actually is going to live. I'm astounded at how garbage that was. You wow. are not alone. Holy shit. He is alive on two hit points. <laughs> well, hey, Fauna, you can get a good yeah. boy. Fauna, Fauna, you're good. What a good boy. <laughs> the chest looks down at you. Oh. <laughs> I already went. I, I, I did. I, 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 All right, yeah, yeah. Yeah, she, yeah, she already went. 21. Yeah, there went, yeah. And still alive and kicking, and standing. All right, pillar mimics. Let's yeet more bricks at the bunny. Uh, this one is disadvantaged on Fauna, and this one is a normal shot on Kiri. Ow! I think I hit both of you. Disadvantage on Fauna when. Oh, uh, is she reckless? Did you reckless? No, I'm not reckless thing right now. All right, then I think oh, okay. the 15 misses you, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah. All right. You are fine. Uh, and then you fucking what mate's gonna go? Slap slam. Uh, miss and I. I don't know if that's a hit on Kiri right now. It just meets, isn't it? 13 on Kiri. Uh, yeah. Uh, let's yeet a brick at Bunny. Hit. Me? Yep. Oh. And Hallie. Uh, might need to do some topping up on you guys. Kiri is the more hurt. She is gonna avoid getting pseudopodded. Come over here and healing word. Nice. And as an action, it's a terribly unlucky throw. Move her last five feet here so that it's at least. Not completely obscured by pillar. Eh. No. We should try. Paji. All right. Well, I don't really need my shadow blade to finish off this boy, so I'm not going to worry about that just yet. Actually, it's a bonus action. What am I saying? Shadowblade third level. It's more the idea, I suppose, of using it now when you aren't going to get a worthwhile swing out of it, and I might be able to kill your concentration, but the odds of me hitting you and doing that are so low. I don't know. You have, like, nine people down here that can focus down. It's and... true. Most of their attacks would be disadvantaged against her, and she's got mirror image, and their damage isn't probably going to take her above the DC 10 
threshold. Why would they? Uh, he's a there, friend. Yeah. yeah. I mean, in that case, you got five uh, people that can shoot. I, th- I think it's that. dark enough, right? Yeah. It oh. is, in fact, quite dead. Oh, no, you're stood right next to Moonbeam Chan. No. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Yeah, there's Moonbeam right What's there. the light on that one? Yeah. Uh, let's see here. Five foot radius. Pale light. Yeah, no, it's it's the light is too strong. Uh, you uh, make a normal attack and miss. Ah, uh, well. All right. So thus begins the mighty brick yeeting. God, there's so many of them that go that one shot on that. I know, right? One after okay. another. Bonra. Hit. Ariel. Miss. Oh god. Uh Paji. Miss. Bornra. Hit me. Eighteen. Uh alright. Fucking two bludgeoning damage. Pathetic. I mean you've gotten me down to under hat. Kiri. Ow. Stop. <laughs> Paddy, Miss, Bonra, Miss, Kiri, Disadvantaged. Its brick is so much dangerous, more dangerous than pseudopods. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's because, it's because when they shoot a brick, they take damage guaranteed to hit or miss. <laughs> That's true. Like, they are absolutely chipping themselves. Uh, eh, we'll throw a disadvantage one at Taji. Fuck it. No, God. Beans, you fucking what, mate? And kills him. <laughs> oh, Oops. poor friend. <laughs> Oopsie. <laughs> Bob. Oh, yeah. Uh, the pillar mimic. I'll glare at the, poor, I'll glare at the mimic that just beans this friend. Eh, it happens. Yeah. They are trying to kill you, you know. Alright. And? She has a point. I can't stop this. I don't think she does. Inside of me. There we go. Uh, wait, what do you do, Bob? I move they move the moving chair. Oh, okay. Gary. All right. Well. Uh, let's let's just go and stab this dude, I guess. All right, you don't want to dance off? Fine. Let's do the dance of battle. Yeah! Hit. And I'm going to smite. Do, 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 Pathetic. Pathetic. But, at the same time, I will use Sparring Smite to give myself 15 temp HP because I need it, Jesus Christ. Yeah, you yeah you're getting struck by a lot of bricks. I, I'm getting bricked pretty... Hold on, I got another swing. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Hit. And uh, I'm also going to take if a you... potion of healing. If you keep getting them to the head, you'll become like Ursula. Oof, Hits. that's a big healing potion. Oh. And... Still, that is another 14 damage. Ariel! Slap. Slap. Alright. Let's see here. 
first one. Second one. Oh, magic pixel. Oh, well. I thought about putting hex on it, but I didn't, so. Oh, well. Life goes on. Conrad. Oh, 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 oh wait. Oh, okay. God, no. I I, like, Voron being ready to action when a creature drops to one hit point is the best. Go wrong, Amidiad. Feast upon its flesh. Gain its power for yourself. You really want mimic power? Okay. No. I mean, it works for mimic, me. Mimic, mimic. I'm gonna start having, to, starting to clear the. Uh, uh sorry? Question mark. Bonk. Good Bonk. Miss. Well, miss and then hit. Miss and then hit. Yep. Yeah, Bill and Mimic, so these guys appear to be having a great time. They're having a great time. I'm having a great time. All right. Disadvantage brick shot. Fauna, 15 miss. Brick shot. Kiri. Oh! <laughs> Domed! Dap, leave me alone. Here, here, you're just getting beat just up. pelted with bricks. <laughs> just pelted with the it. shield of faith does nothing. <laughs> Your faith can't defeat brick. <laughs> oh Morgan, god! Please, all oh, the people in front of the brick. What is a god to a brick? <laughs> Who are those at? Are, are those I'm... also at me? Yes. Fuck! You, leave me alone. <laughs> God damn! <laughs> Get fucking power it? uppercutted and then struck again. Oh. What is a god to a brick? <laughs> Apparently not fucking much, Morgan. Come on. Ugh. Ugh. Ow. Do you? Do you still? Glad you had the, all the healing there. And I missed the fauna. Hallie. Uh. Hmm. Help. Uh, move. And let's make it a good one. Twenty six. Ah, oh, that's the good stuff right there. Did did our boy take damage for starting turn of Moonbeam Chan? Oh, oh yeah, I need to do that. Give me a moment. Uh, also. Uh, you know what, she'd have thrown this before she headed over and missed anyway. Terrible. <laughs> Jesus. Luckily, it returns. I'm just going to do the damage instead of bothering with a save, just in the interest of sparing myself some freaking time. The odds of Moonbeam Chan hitting are that high. Uh, all right, Taji. All right. Same, you only had access to one fireball because that is just like fireball central down there. Mm hmm. Oh, this boy is right here. Yep. That is it. 17. Nearly drop him. Yeah. Okay, and a brick for Taddy. That would be a hit. What does mirror image say? Okay. It says pop. Right, let's pseudopod and aerial. 16, nope. no. Pseudopod of Fauna. Nope. Cannot roll those. Pseudopod of Bob. Maybe. Yeah. Uh, seven damage for Bob. And this guy's the one. That... Uh, ten foot reach. Yes. Ah, okay. Uh, then yes, that's uh damage. And brick a carry. Nope. Finally, they learned how to miss. Right. No, it's just you're huddled down in like the field position after being bricked so many times. <laughs> <laughs> just in the field position making sad puppy noises. Ah. Bricks! So many bricks! Alright, pseudopod Taji. 
No. Rick shot. Bonra. Uh, yeah. Uh, disadvantage brick shot carry. And as soon as Punchy Boy comes down, I think I actually am gonna go lay down. <laughs> I think I'll have disadvantage. Uh, I think that's gonna hit Fonra. You just gotta army crawl across the floor while I was break dancing with your sword. Bob. I just keep the concentration going, and uh, you know what? I'm an throw. Let's see if I. Oh, hang on. Well, I got the concentration going. That's uh, just going. So mm -hmm. let's see. That's one. Yep. Okay. Pale mimic. Yeah, did I? More like pale yeah. mimic. In the it's in the light. Uh, that's the one that took the that damage, correct? Whoop. Misclick. <laughs> you suddenly become naked. You sure you want you don't you don't want to like just throw your armor off? No, I I really don't. Uh, no, I think that's that's pretty much it for me. Okey pokey. Oh god. Jesse uh, is going to throw a knife at this dude first, and then stab at the pillar so that she's not wasting a sneak attack. Ha! Huh. Huh. All right, good plan. All right, she drops the pillar and nails this fucking boy for uh, 16, 20, 27. That was all of our luck him. for this entire dungeon just had condensed right into that turn. Yep. Defeated. Ariel, you're up. Okay, on to the... Jesse suddenly put in some fucking work. All right, on to the next one in the line. On another one. Whack. Whack. Hit, hit. All right. 12, 22, 14. 26, 27. Don't forget your shapeshifter bonus. I have it in there. there That's the radiant it. damage there. That is the radiant, right, yeah. I'm just used, so used to so many extra numbers being attached to attacks. I'm like, oh, don't forget you've got all of your extra numbers. Fun, yeah. you're out. Uh, whack. Whack. Ooh. Bonk and bonk. Uh, first one is 13 and so 5. Okay, and then your next one hits. And it goes down. Exactly. Nicely done. And for your grand service, I reward you with a brick. 20. Darn. <laughs> bonk. Carrie. Bonk. Leave me alone. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Look how much look how low these guys' health is getting, and it's just from yeeting bricks at you. <laughs> I mean they they've and gone the fireball. They, they got hit in the initial fireball, but after that it's just like fucking brick suicide. <laughs> Alright, and then you fucking what mate's gonna square up on you. Still Uka chuckering. Swing swing. What, what is this? He's a beast. <laughs> this man can't be stopped. I gotta go down. God damn. You, yeah, you are. <laughs> shield of Faith still up, though? You can't miss me How anymore. did Shield of Faith, though? You're so full of faith, even though this is going so poorly for the you. The Shield of Faith doesn't matter. <laughs> 19, I, I miss you. Ding. That would have missed even. me without the Shield of Faith. Yeah. Hallie. Uh, Hell uh, no. Uh, <laughs> 
Uh, let's let's do a CD. Uh, yeah. for you on four. Sure. How much to get you to half? Uh, God, let's see. Uh, what's the range on that one? Day. Oh, yes, that would be. Oh, uh, no. she'll, she'll run around and get in range for both of you. Seventeen to get me to half. Okay. How much to get four hundred to half? Uh, twenty. Twenty-one. Okay, cool. You're up to half. Very efficient use of it. Only two points left over. Well, I didn't click that, but okay, whatever. Just so you're aware, mimics are really good at grappling. No, really. I, yeah, I sort of expect weird. that outside the Crazy dungeon. Crazy how that happens, huh? I actually expect that to be the case outside the dungeon. Or in that uh, version, no, those ones actually did not have grappler, weirdly. Yeah, I, I know. That's what I'm saying. Like, I expect that outside the dungeon. No, it's happening inside right. the dungeon. Well. And uh, an extra healing word for the doggo. Thank you. A, a juicy one. Time to get pelted by more bricks. Yeah, it's brick <laughs> hell time for you again here. All in a right, we're about to get brickening. Uh, Taji, can you finish off what, one, right. of the, one of these mighty brick beasts? I think so. Let's see. No, you, know you are blessed, but I don't think that's ever. No, that's not good. Oh, I know you're in dim light again now. Uh, the blessed could mean a hit. Yes, I am. That's 14. Uh, I think you had to roll pretty high on the blast to hit. Oh, yeah. 14 no. is a no. And you don't have to go for massively. Their AC is not actually astoundingly high. Uh, but That's... slightly better than that. Sorry, I thought you said a uh, bless would be a hit. But right, well, so, she... Not... so she doesn't start in fucking movie in chat. All right, so... Fauna, Brick. Two damage. This is getting so softened of bricks. This guy is off the list. This Tenderized. one. Pseudopod, Ariel. Ariel, welcome no, to Sticky that's Land. Scary. Scary is being tenderized. Yeah. Yeah. A23 will hit me. What? You're sticky. What's. What's sticky? I am sticky. Oh, no, you're not. I can't. You're oily. Yeah, you're right. I am oily. Gone. All right. Brick. Shot. And once again, being a pup. No. 15 damage. <laughs> also, it uh, started in Moonbeam Chan if you'd like to roll that damage. Very well. I shall indeed do that. Also, I forgot it for you fucking what, mate, actually. It should have gotten some damage when it started. My... Uh... Okay, and uh, go in order. Ah. Uh -huh. Well, both. Okay. This one, Pseudopod. Taji. Do it actually hit you, though? This one, Brick, Bob, Wham. No. Fucking Brick. Who the fuck Brick, man? This is a pillar of air. Yeah, this guy here. Ah, okay. Damn it. I thought it was out of range. Fuck, okay, that's my own fault. Want to save? Yes. Uh, let's see. First. Disadvantage shot. That's a miss on Gary. Huh. They do feel a brick in herds. Feel the face continuing not to do anything. And uh, that's a hit on Fauna. Oh, another brick. Considering most of the damage I've been dealing to Fauna has been physical, it's kind of astounding how much I've managed to do to Fauna with Brick. Yeah. Ow. These bricks fucking hurt, mate! It's because you keep throwing so many bricks! 
so many bricks. I'm having the fucking wildest time throwing bricks at you. <laughs> it's you so like, stupid we, you've how got much I'm enjoying like this. Bob, you're out. For turn. <laughs> God damn it. Could you zap this guy, please? Well, you want to fin finish off the what? mighty you want me? Fierce warrior of time. Yes. To be fair, I think he dies literally even if Bob rolls fucking snake eyes on the damage for Moonbeam Chan again. Yeah, but like I said, it uh, was on, on his turn. Yeah. On my turn, I can do... Uh, let's see if I can succeed with this. Uh, which target was that, sorry? Was that on you fucking what, mate? Yes. Oh, you hit him. You go down. Bleh. Oh. <sighs> Gary. Morgan's ass. That hurts. Ugh. Chug. Such a juicy push. Yeah, it's why they're so expensive. Yeah. Okay. Um, I'm gonna Let's see one, two. Go prone. I mean, they're already firing a disadvantage. You know what, actually? Can these guys shoot through their uh, other pillars? Uh, from what you've seen, yes. Damn it. They are not really inhibited by the line of sight of their companions. That's unfortunate. Alright, well, still and all. Yeah, that would be pretty tragic failing for them because they're all pillars. Otherwise, you could just defeat them by standing dead ass down a line here. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you know, it'd, it'd be a shame if tactics were in any way helpful. Alright. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, now that you're done with the you what, mate, you're now attacking things that are really easy to hit. Yeah. And uh you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna go prone. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's see here. Jess is going to come here and try and finish off the Pillar Mimic that Taji is fighting and free her up. Nope. Yep, exactly drops it. Oh. No, it misses. Uh, what? Why? Why? They, she, they have a 10 foot range. Uh, consider to be in you only way. have the disadvantage yeah, while you're that's, adjacent. That's not how that works, Bob. Oh, it's oh, okay. direct adjacent? Yes, it's within five feet. Well, time to use a smite. Sure. I have a warlock slot, so might as well. On a crit smite, you know, that's how yeah. it goes. That's a lot of fucking ones, though. Yeah. It is enough. All right, the second blow does in fact hit and drops it. 5, 10, 15, 20, 5. Continue on down the line. And that's it for me. Okay. Bonra! The pillars begin to fall. Yes, they do. Knock, knock. Hi, who's there? Uh-oh. <laughs> hit, uh, hit. Yeah, no, they do? Yeah. Okay. Okay, if they need number, Kina. Oh. Oh, okay. All right. This one will also shout, Knock, knock, brick! <laughs> Uh oh. Hits its friend. Oops. It's immune to the acid, but it'll take nine. <laughs> Oops.
This one will make an advantaged pseudopod swing down at you. 11 damage, Kiri! No! And that's going to miss a fauna. On Hallie's turn. Uh, let's see here. Um, let's. Well, you know, we'll save a heal this time, uh, and hit a thing instead. Commit. Don't. What you get for using Papa's fist and not a javelin? Yeah, I should have. I should have used the jab. Well, I think the I'll jab throw up this one right here. Mods. Oh yeah, it could hit with a with a bless, couldn't it? Hallie no, she's blessed. not blessed. She's, she's not, blessed. not blessed. I see yeah, that now. I was saying that the javelin, the javelin has plus modifier, so it would have hit. Papa's fist is masterwork, so no, the two hits are the same. It doesn't matter. She rolled fist anyway. Yeah. yeah regardless of that fact, fist. I did also, I did literally look before I made her walk up and hit with Papa's fist. They are both plus sevens to hit. Fair enough. In fact, not tra right. tragically stupid. Well. 24. That is a hit for sure. And it drops it. Alright, this pillar mimic is gonna yeet brick at Fauna. Bonk. Uh, yeah. This one is out. This one starts its turn, rolled the moonbeam damage. At the same time, it is going to yeet a brick at Fauna. Bonk. I'm going to be one big bruise. Yeah, tell me about it. Don't you see? They're fucking tenderizing, y'all. Yes, I do see that, and I'm really fucking tender now. 17 damage on Ariel, and then this yeah. is going to yeet another brick. Disadvantage, Ouch. because you're lying down, miss. And another brick of Fauna. Miss. <sighs> Bob. You know... You know what's actually really cool about the Fatal Movement Oil is that it only takes five feet of your movement to get up from prone. What? From prone? Yes. No, doesn't it take half your movement to get up from prone? No. Freed. Freedom of movement. Yeah, under oh, freedom of movement. Okay. Under All, right. Yes. All right. Freedom of movement. While you're under that effect, it takes under. Five feet. Yeah, that's okay. true. You gotta get down and get back up again, and nothing can keep you down. But yeah, Bob, do a thing. Uh, okay, uh, this one. This pillar. You say this, but I don't see you pointing. Okay. God, I wonder what happened if Carrie used those fucking fireballs as anal beads. That's a really dangerous game right there. I mean, she yeah, was. That's where they yeah. came from. Oh. Oh, oh. yeah, you're fire resistant. Yeah, exactly. You don't care. Hot and dangerous. I like it. Let's cure in a nutshell. Uh, let's see here. Hit. 
Okay, Gary. Wow, I only got hit once that whole turn. Amazing. The power Incredible. of lying down. Incredible. I know. <laughs> Stand up and beat this guy now. Uh, Incredible. The power of yeah. lying down. Yeah. Hit. I crit, crit something. Dead. I did kill it. Bonk. All right. Uh, you know what? I'm just going to go prone again. Sure. <laughs> Makes sense. Are you not going to move and then go prone? Why? Well, yeah, that would get an advantage when they have a single uh, pod. Yeah, you don't want to be in melee with him. That's a good point. All right, Jesse. Uh, is going to come help with this this dude. It is thus far not been hit yet, and that seems like a bad idea. Hit, hit. Good thing she held that first sneak attack. That's way better than the second. Yep. 17 total. Ariel. Yep. I Getting continue to slap and... your movement. Slap and slap. Hit and hit. 16, 23, 24. Oh, yeah, you're on a tear now. Bonra. Next. Uh oh, says the pillar. <laughs> Okay, it's a series of wham. Two, fourteen, two, thirteen, six. Bonk, bonk. And then this one's defeated. This one's defeated. Bricks for Fauna. Fauna loves bricks. I love bricks. Bonk. Especially when they hit me in the face. Allie, uh, let's see here. Could do a channel divinity, but there's still more bricking to go, and I think that you can, you can probably make it through another round without losing consciousness. So she will just eat a jab. Patch. All right. Just systematically dispatch them. Heck yeah. 18? Uh, 18 is certainly a hit. Does GFB finish oh, the job? And... Yep. It I'm does. Like... Right before it's go. All right, this one starts in Moonbeam Chan. Show me the damage, Bob. I'll just move past that guy, just watching him slowly roast. Okay. Still kicking. And for your discretions, Bob, you get... Brick. Oh, look at that. 30 feet. I have a gift for you. It's Brick. Oh, I actually fucking... I miss. I miss a bob with a brick. Tragic. Yeah. Okay. Pseudopods for Ariel. Crit. Again. <laughs> Could you not? Just Can you stop critting me with this thing? Disadvantage brick for Kiri. Dodges a crit. Lucky Whoa. you. Based prone tactics. <laughs> The fucking legitimately prone tactics. This is like fucking 40k all of a sudden. I get up. I shoot. I'm prone. <laughs> all right, bricks for Fauna. Still alive and bricking. Bob. Okay. I. Let's try this. And the fucker just threw the brick at me. No, oh, wait, that's the wrong one. Okay. <laughs> you create a tiny harmless sensory effect. Oh, oh okay. no, you deal oh. some damage. How threatening. How terrifying. Okay, it's still alive, somehow. 
<laughs> Even more oh, of a magic, magic pixel. pixel is it? Theory. All right, I'm going to get up. Yeah. Slowly make my way over here. Hello, pretty statue That's a lot of movement. You can't do that. Yes, I can. Uh, no, it's been getting five up feet. still always costs half your movement. I no, I have freedom five feet thing. Fucking movement. Where does it say freedom that? Freedom of movement does... Oh, it doesn't. did Bob just lie to me? Okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah Andrew no was wrong. Okay. Well, should have known. All right. In that case, one, two, three, four. It's like everything but prone. Actually. Yeah, no, the, it only says you can spend one, two, five feet of movement to automatically escape from non-magical restraints. I have feet of movement speed. Oh, you're foy. All right. Heck. Yeah, I'm a fucking glory paladin. We get zoomies. Nice. Yeah, uh, no. I'm gonna come over here and say, "Hi, pretty statue lady. Please don't kill me." Mm -hmm. Oh no, I won't do that. Oh, thanks. Appreciate it. Yeah. Eh, no problem. Stab your. Not friend. looking to party with these guys, huh? Oh no, nah, not interested. I'm just here to watch the show. Cool. All right. Yeah. Stab this guy uh, twice and then drop run. Uh, 40 plus 10. What adorable puppy. Well, thank you. Here he's ass up, does a wag. Ha <laughs> ha. Brick me, bitch. <laughs> that sounded like Britney, bitch. Britney, bitch. That was the, that was the joke. Nice. Hey. No, no luck with the second one. And why did I get a like an empty sneak attack that I unticked it? Well, I guess I did mm. it too quickly. Ariel. Yep. Slap. Slap. Fucking very slap. Yeah, he's out. All right. Five, ten, fifteen, twenty-five, thirteen. Oh, good. Finally making my way down this way. The top row's done. Make my way down. Making your way downtown. I'm glad the statues decided not to intervene in this. Yeah, no. I've, why would I intervene? You never You're know. Being intervened on plenty enough, I think. Yeah. Bonner. Uh, just gotta keep making my way downtown. Mm -hmm. Whack. You're gonna get these songs stuck in my head. Whack. Hit, hit. It's bold words coming from you. Fucking, I can't stop this feeling. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's time for disadvantaged bricks, because pseudopods are not going to drop you before it's too late. Oh my god, who gives a shit about disadvantage? Yeah, who gives a shit uh... about disadvantage? Just roll high. Just roll really good all the time. Alright, Hallie's going to... CD. Get yourself up to half. Literally just smash, you know, like, grab, smash a brick to support his face at point blank. Yeah. Funner, you receive Channel of any Half health. Diana. All right. This boy's turn. What high? That's a miss. Oh, you got blast. Uh, with blast. Actually, that might now be in range of this torch here. Yeah, afraid so. No longer dim light. Ah, uh, well. Can't hit even with a blast. Pillar Mimic starts its turn next to Moonbeam Chan. It dies even on Snake Eyes. This pillar mimic. Disadvantaged bricks. Double power. Kiri. Bricks. Leave me alone. <laughs> 22 is a hit, and then an 18 is a miss. Uh, well, I dodged Shield another faith. crit. Shield of Faith continually doing it. nothing for you. Yes. You are dodging crits with it, yeah. What was that? Nine with ba damage? based prone strats. Yeah. Ah, yeah. Oh. ow, my butt. Oh. Hey. 
Wasn't that a double move to get Moonbeam Chan all the way down there? Oh no, yeah, you used an action to move Moonbeam Chan. No bonus. And then you moved your move. Okay, Gary. Alright. We stand up, we stab, we fall over again. Alrighty. Oh no, Hit my sword. And miss. Huh? Oh, uh, here. The statue reaches down and plucks up your sword and hands it back. Uh, there you go. You're Aww. almost done with the fight after all. You're such a sweetie. Thank you. Yeah, I hear that from time to time. Soul knife. Soul knife. Second one is a hit. A resounding hit with a solid fucking sneak attack on it. Ariel. All right. Let's see. 5, 10, 15, 25, 30. Move down here. I'm going to whack twice. Aye. Whack. Whack. <laughs> you crit, and That's then you the, hit. what, third double crit we've seen today? Yeah, um... I still have a warlock slot, so let's go ahead and use that and try and just take this guy down completely. Sure. Feels appropriate to use it on a crit. Uh huh. Yep. 21. Ooh, close. No cigar. And then I will drop prone. <laughs> I see you're all assuming the arse up stance. It's it's a good choice. I don't mind the view. I worked very hard to have, make sure that view is very good. Yep, no kidding. Fauna, your guy. Uh, let's see if I can knock this one down in one. Oh, I missed. No, nope. I cannot. And that is exactly enough to drop it. I'm right just... before it's go, the true tragedy. I'm just going to sit down. I'm getting a headache from all these bricks. Fucking bonk. Uh, this pillar is totally owned by a javelin. Thaji. All right. And then I'm just gonna... Why did you just yeet a sword into my face? <laughs> Too close 19, to... I don't think 19 hits you, fortunately. <laughs> <laughs> Luckily, uh, no. Oh, right, I'm behind. Right, I'm block blocking the light right now. No, no, it's in the one is a crit fail. 19 doesn't hit her. Uh, you are, in fact, still in light. Yeah, you are, you yeah. are like, 10 feet from it. Uh, yeah, if I'd stop on the other side, Starts right. in Moonbeam Chan. Roll me the damage, please. Uh, let's see if we can get one last Hell's Heart brick in. I believe in you. You can get that brick. Uh, oh, I can. I can get one last brick. Kill yourself with this brick. Let's go. Oh. Oh. Terrible throw. Bob. Finishing blow. Last guy. Just don't roll like snake eyes on your frostbite or something. I want to punch him to death. Alright, that's not Snake Eyes. That's pretty good. I passed. Oh. Fury! <laughs> Hunch. Okay, you hit. I do six, no, five damage. Alright, it is enough. Hey, well done, guys. Oh, um, however, you might want to get rid of that moon beam. You're kind of destroying the ceiling. Oh, Bob, come on. Bob, do you do as the uh, statue asks? Oh, yeah. Sorry, I've muted myself. Yes, I snap it away. Uh, thanks. Oh, very stylish. I like the snap. The statue snaps a few times. It's considerably a lot louder. Um, but yeah, unfortunately, the downside to fighting a whole bunch of creatures that are pillars means they were kind of holding up the ceiling here, so you guys uh, might want to might wanna hurry, about and, that? hurry yes, and scoot on um, in. Uh, damn it. Uh, okay. Yeah. Are, are you, you gonna be okay? Huh? Oh yeah, I'm fine. Yeah. Uh, I this is my I job. I'm like boss awesome this. You don't mind us going through, yes? No, no go for it. Uh, 
Oh, one second. Uh, she concentrates for a moment, and these two mimics are deposited in either hand. Uh, let's see here. Uh, if you just all gather nice and closely. Uh, here's some loot. Uh, she'll tip the uh, you what mates upside down and shake them a few times. <laughs> oh, well, thank uh, you very much. Place, place them down. There you go. They'll be fine. You have oh, been good, good to hear. Very kind and helpful. Huh? Um. Yeah. I mean, it's not interesting unless I'm helpful. Sometimes. Oh. You are indeed very interesting and very pretty. Indeed. Oh. Uh, you're gonna make me blush. I can't blush. I'm a statue, but I'll blush anyway. Uh, on you go. Uh, grab party, and then we will roll the loot and probably call it there for the day, just because there's still a little bit more dungeon to go. Nice. Okay. As you're this has all been so great, Scal. Scooted yes. downstairs with your spoils. Let's just make sure that I haven't completely fucked the lighting up it on this. It feels like, almost like what 5th edition was made to be, like a dungeon run. I have no idea what you're talking about. Ah, you got rid of me. At ah. last. Oh no, I'm gone. <laughs> I'm gone. I'm... Oh wow, yeah, oh, everyone's just gone. Huh. Ah. Every, oh, everyone's token right. advantage from themselves. Uh, oh, it needs to be legacy lighting, of course. I was like, that's why it was being weird. Save. There you go. Okay. Cool. Uh, All right. Let's see. You find yourself going down a set of, set of stairs, and then in the center of this set of stairs is an incredibly tiny staircase. I can't but... get down there. Oh, you could. It's just a bit of a squeeze. You have to stoop. I, I just about couldn't fit down there. My butt might be a bit too wide. Well, I'm yeah. sure somebody yeah. wouldn't mind giving just, me a push. I it just little. looks at being fucking small. I can't see it's a fucking... damn thing. Uh, can you not see it at all? I can give you a push. I don't mind pushing on the cushion. Uh, right, there are no light sources right now. Let me uh, activate Halley. Halley light power. Uh, all players see lights. 20, 40, save. There you go. All good? That's nice. There you go. All right, so. The loot that was in the you what mates. Or the you fucking what mates, sorry. Okay. Let's see. What? Wait, let's see if I can get. Mm. 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 Generate. Oh, yeah, this is the one there I use for all the fucking yes. ridiculous uh, uh, books. If I tell it to print a fuck ton of books. Go. The holy brick on a rope. <laughs> oh. <laughs> right. The brick on a rope. Alright, so. You get. 2,000 gold. Yeesh. Oh. Oh my. Uh, a spell scroll of healing word. That's good. That's what nice. uh, what level of healing word? First level. Okay. Uh, three potions of healing, one of which is superior. Oh, that's good. A scroll of fairy fire. Oh, nice. Who gets fairy fire these days? Who can even cast fairy fire? It's probably either Bob. you or Bob. There you go, Bob. Bard druid. Oh, just bard druid? Yep. Then it yep. goes to Bob.
some masterwork sexy robes. They appears to be a black corset with flared hips with ribbons, a sheer material dress and sleeves. Ooh. Someone give that to Cass. Some navigator's tools. Cute. I'll give that first. <laughs> a book titled Pictures of Cats. A picture book full of photos of cats dressed in cute outfits and doing cute things. It's about the size of an average dictionary. Amazing. What the hell? I'll take that. And one square yard of linen. Oh. Yeah, if nobody stops me, I will take the masterwork sexy robes. There you go. And yes, <laughs> literally pictures of cats. A picture book full of photos of cats dressed in cute outfits and doing cute things. Excellent. All right, and now we jump to experience. Experience. Mm -hmm. Yay. Experience. Well, we sure explored a new interesting location. Yeah. Yeah, yeah we yeah. have. We discovered many interesting new truths, such as... Yeah, why don't you tie it off with you? Uh, the dreams of the gods from another realm that yeah. mimics have some cosmic connection to the astral plane. Yeah. Or ethereal plane. Both, Both apparently. One of them. Oh. Uh, make a new ally or a lasting enemy? Mm, I don't think know. so. Actually, no. You have met your greatest ally. You just don't know it yet. Interesting. So, do we get yeah. out Yeah, you'll huh? get that point. Advance oh, okay. completing a quest. Yep. All Defeat right. a threat far beyond expectations. No. I don't know. <laughs> fucking actually, to quick, well, let me, let me do a quick God. check. Yeah, let me let me do a quick check on that CR. Actually, it might have been uh, Kobo Fight Club. What is fucking experience allowance these days? Quite high, considering we do have a minion with us. Players six, levels eight. Uh, then I'm just gonna grab and buy CR. Uh, nope, it was still on the realm of deadly. Okay. It was a tough fight, but nothing you couldn't defeat. So, Fair 4 XP? Uh, we're still going down the list. Learn something new about a player character. Oh, that's right. Yeah, Tayana exists in the ethereal realm, apparently. Yep. Okay. Or at least while she's here, she's she does. She has also got, she's also got a work visa for the council. Or, sorry, a guest visa. <laughs> a tourist visa. Guest that visa. Was it. Tourist visa, yes. I'll mark that on my sheet. Yeah, you have, a, you, have a, you have a tourist visa. Then make sure that is on. Yeah, she uh, counts enough to be considered a mimic, at least. We can count that, at least. Yep. So yeah, that's five experience for everybody. Um, nice. since we, since you did say we make a new ally, does that there was count? a lot of fucking undue harm to your friend? <laughs> no, that's not. That doesn't say undue harm. That says undue distress. I, yeah. There was yeah, a lot no. of distress. Um, it's pretty similar. Here's, here's, here's the thing. I I can't say that. For sh I can't let you score in your commitment. Because not only do you not know you have this ally, the ally is... I, I can't even tell you, unfortunately. All right. It would spoil so, things. So if, we, so if we find the ally and get to know them, then maybe that counts in. The odds are very against you, but yes. Okay. Just felt it for, for asking, since we apparently have an ally here. You do. You absolutely have your best ally ever. However, you don't know it. Let's Weird. see, I don't think anything towards my oath really came into play today, huh? Nope. I don't think so. You'll certainly have a story to tell when you're done here. Assuming you're allowed sure. to tell any of it, you might not actually. You, they might put you under an NDC. <laughs> I'll be speaking about the Mimic Council, you understand. Yeah, non-disclosure yeah. contracts. Yeah. You'll all have to sign them. I'm so miffed that Scow got to do the Mimic Council before I did. <laughs> what hey, did you think the mimic dungeon been, was going to be? You've been teasing it for a while. You just had to actually pull the trigger and bring it up. 
he never really did the whole. Well, there was the only mention is was uh, the disappearance, and that's it. It is true. I have barely, I am barely scratching the surface of the mimic council. But you know, there is so much, there is so much fuel for that particular fire that I don't dare touch. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> because the mimic council are it's... a meta resource. <laughs> yeah, the fact that it uh, also exists in the multiverse is a different thing, so it's very dangerous to start cementing. All right. Well, that being said, if you're watching on the stream of YouTube, thanks for tuning in. We'll see you in a couple hours for Mers and Hammer, maybe possibly. Till then, adios and have a good one.